My name is Ben Starr and I play Clive Rossfield in Final Fantasy XVI. I don't recall ever pledging allegiance to your Emperor. My service may have been bought with this brand, but not my loyalty. I just fight to survive. He's far from invincible. In fact, when we meet him, he's broken. He's completely destroyed. It was remarkable, actually, how much that resonated with me and that sense of just needing a little bit of hope and a little bit of faith. I'm most excited for the people to see his journey. I feel up to this point, there is this idea that he's out for one thing and one thing only, and that is revenge. There is so much more to Clyde than that, and I can't wait for people to discover that as they play it. I can't wait for them to collect all the icon powers with him and kind of collect the experiences that you're going to have with him along that journey. Not another step. <laughs> I mean it. Well, I'm not about to leave her here. Not one with a warm bed waiting. It's all right. My name's Ralph Einson, and I voice Adolphus Tillman. So he's, he's fun, and he gets to uh, puncture the seriousness of a lot of moments in the game with his humor and trying to stop Clive, who has got a kind of emo edge to him um, compared to Sid. You all right? Never better. Sounds like it. Sid's a much more kind of straightforward man, and I think that relationship between the two of them is quite a lot of fun. I will be your monster no more. Nor will I suffer you to create another. My name's Susanna Fielding, and I voice Jill in Final Fantasy XVI. My powers awoke, and everything changed. She's got a really interesting journey. When we first meet her, she's in a very vulnerable, damaged place, and there's a real kind of transition into a, a new version of Jill as the game goes on. So that was probably the most sort of interesting emotional journey to play, and certainly one of the like most 3D emotional characters that I've ever played on a video game. How? Oh! How did you do it? How did you even survive? How? Oh! My name is Nina Indis, and I voice Benedicta Harmon in Final Fantasy XVI. She's such a complex, well-rounded character. I think it's easy to judge a book by its cover. I asked you a question, Lord Commander. There's so much to her. I'm just excited for the fans to get to know her, uh, as well as I got to know her during the recording. The Iron Blood will rule the day they set foot on Storm. This game is over. My name is Alex Annie Pekin, and I play Hugo Kupka in Final Fantasy VI. I think the most interesting thing about playing Hugo is the fact that he has this incredible power and how to express that because he is a statesman, he is a politician, he has the ability to be really eloquent and statesmanlike. But at the same time, he has this just raw energy and power that also flows through him. And just knowing when that comes to life and when it doesn't and kind of where he fits in the wider territory of Valisthea and the Six Kingdoms. One cannot change one's nature through force of will alone. Only the Almighty can do that. My name's David Menken and I play Barnabas Tharn. Barnabas is one of the most interesting characters I've had the pleasure of playing. He is completely driven to his purpose. He knows that everything he does will lead to the destruction of the world as he knows it, but he knows that it's the only way for life to go on. This game kind of ticks all the boxes. Everything's just been raised a level. You're in for an epic ride and just enjoy every second. Dive in, enjoy it, and uh, what a world. Obviously you're gonna lose against me, but that's okay, you can try again. It's so cool, <laughs> so come on in. It's going to be amazing. PlayStation.